fashion. You can't escape it from walking with crowds of people to retail stores at every corner. But if that's not enough, there is a way to have fashion literally at your fingertips. 17 Magazine and Teen Vogue and Vogue. Fashion magazines. However, you may see changes in the next couple of years. Fashion magazines are set to be shifting from paper to online. Advertisement in fashion magazines have gone down 22% since 2008. Fashion magazines, like Glamour, rely on boutiques like this to finance their advertising. Marketing professor Kathy O'Donnell believes this is the future. A lot of it is going to go online and um, I think that uh, it's very expensive, as you know, to produce and, and, and mail a magazine. Fashion magazines are now partnering with online retailers to help sell content and also help with advertising. Here's the catch. The website will direct you to independent stores or boutiques where you can buy the item. This is how it works. If you see something you like in a magazine, you can go to the website and find where you can buy it. And the magazine charges the store an advertising fee. Though technology may help some magazines from completely shutting down, some believe you cannot beat the original. People in my generation still love the idea of taking a magazine with us on the plane or to the pool. But at the end of the day, it may not matter where you receive your fashion. It may just be a state of mind. The only place that you can look to find fashion tips and expertise is in your heart and how you feel.